हेलो फ्यूचर डॉक्टर्स वेलकम टू दिपेनिज्म आई एम डॉक्टर दिपेन शाह एंड प्रीवियस सेगमेंट में हम लोगों ने डिस्कस किया था अबाउट द डब्ल्यू बी सीज एंड इट्स वेरियस कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स आज के सेगमेंट में हम लोग डिस्कस करेंगे अबाउट द टाइप्स ऑफ डब्ल्यू बी सीज नव ल्यूकोसाइट्स आर मेनली क्लासिफाइड इन टू टू कैटेगरीज दैट इज द ग्रैन्यूलोसाइट्स एंड द ए ग्रैन्यूलोसाइट्स The major difference is granulocytes contains presence of granules in their cytoplasm, whereas the A granulocytes they do not contain granules in their cytoplasm. So, in the granulocytes category, there are three examples. That is the neutrophil, eosinophil, and basophil. In A granulocytes, there are mainly two types of WBCs. That is the lymphocytes and the monocytes. So these are the five major types of WBCs that we are going to discuss. So let us begin first with the neutrophils. Now neutrophils, as the name suggests, the filling means the affinity, and neutro means neutral dyes. So these neutrophils are going to be stained by certain neutral dyes. So उनके अंदर जो cytoplasmic granules हैं, उनको stain करके हम लोग microscope के अंदर उनको study कर सकते हैं. So they are neutrophils. Neutrophils may they have presence of a nucleus which has three to five lobes. So when you observe the nucleus, it is showing three to five lobes. Hence, it is known as polymorphonuclear leukocyte. So nucleus के अलग-अलग lobes होने की वजह से it appears polymorphic and it is known as PMNLS. That is polymorphonuclear leukocytes. In general, neutrophils का concentration in the total WBC count is the maximum. They are present around 54 to 62 percent of all the total WBCs. Uh, the neutrophils has the major role that it performs phagocytosis. The phagocytosis means engulfing the microbes. So it surrounds the bacteria and completely digests it. So phagocytosis is one of the major function of the neutrophils. Moving to the next type of cell, that is the eosinophils. The eosinophils are mainly stained by the acidic dyes like eosin. So hence the name eosinophil. And since eosin is an acidic dye, eosinophils are also known as acidophils. In general, inca concentration is around one to three percent out of the total WBCs. And जब भी उनका न्यूक्लियस ऑब्जर्व करें तो न्यूक्लियस में इट शोज प्रेजेंस ऑफ अ बाइलोब्ड न्यूक्लियस दैट इज द न्यूक्लियस शोज टू लोब्स अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस इोसिनोफिल्स का मेजर फंक्शन जो रहेगा दैट इज द इंक्रीज ड्यूरिंग एलर्जिक रिएक्शन सो ड्यूरिंग एलर्जिक रिस्पॉन्स इट इज द इोसिनोफिल काउंट विच इंक्रीजेस जिसको हम लोग बोलते हैं एज इोसिनोफिलिया वन मोर इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट फॉर योर नीट एमसीक्यूज किसी भी तरह का पैरासाइटिक इन्फेक्शन होगा इवन ड्यूरिंग पैरासाइटिक इन्फेक्शन इोसिनोफिल काउंट इंक्रीजेस लाइक एस्केरियासिस हो गया या टीनियासिस हो गया सो इन सच पैरासाइटिक इन्फेक्शन इोसिनोफिल काउंट इंक्रीजेस ऑल्सो इोसिनोफिल का एक मेजर रिस्पॉन्स है दैट इज दे हैव एंटी हिस्टामिनिक रिस्पॉन्स जो जो हिस्टामिन का रिस्पॉन्स की वजह से इन्फ्लोमेशन के साइंस प्रोड्यूस होंगे तो उनको सेटल डाउन करा देगा डिक्रीज करा देगा सो इोसिनोफिल हैज द एंटी हिस्टामिनिक रिस्पॉन्स मूविंग टू द थर्ड टाइप ऑफ ग्रैन्यूलोसाइट दैट इज द बेजोफिल्स नाउ बेजोफिल्स एज द नेम सजेस्ट दे आर गोइंग टू बी स्टेन्ड बाई द बेजिक डाइज लाइक द मिथिलीन ब्लू इनका कॉन्सेंट्रेशन काफी कम है दैट इज अराउंड 0.5 टू 1 परसेंट एंड जब भी उनका न्यूक्लियस हम लोग ऑब्जर्व करते द न्यूक्लियस इज अ ट्विस्टेड न्यूक्लियस लाइक अ फिगर ऑफ एट सो दैट इज देयर कैरेक्टरिस्टिक फीचर द रोल ऑफ बेजोफिल्स इज इट मेनली सिक्रीट्स हिस्टामिन नाउ हिस्टामिन वेन एवर दर इज अ टिश्यू डैमेज द रिलीज ऑफ हिस्टामिन प्रोड्यूस Inflammatory response. हम लोग बहुत सारे conditions पढ़ते हैं और उन conditions में अगर suffix itis आता है it means inflammation. For example, dermatitis, neuritis, conjunctivitis, hepatitis. तो ये जितने भी conditions these are inflammatory. और main response कौन दे रहा है इसमें histamine का release which has been secreted by the basophils. So what are these inflammatory signs? There are mainly five major signs of inflammation. that is redness swelling pain heat and loss of function to ye five signs jo honge they are representing the inflammatory responses because of the histamine 
another substance that is secreted by basophils is the heparin now heparin serves as an anticoagulant which keeps the blood in the fluid state so this is one of the natural anticoagulant that is present in the blood so we have discussed about the three types of granulocytes moving to the the category of a granulocytes the first type that we are discussing are the lymphocytes now lymphocytes are the cells which are present in a concentration of around 25 to 30 percent of the total wbcs in fact lymphocytes ka nucleus hoga it is a large and a round nucleus and since cytoplasmic granules are absent so in me a granulocytes ka category mein inko rakha gaya hai apart from this lymphocytes ka major function jo hai that is production of antibodies but remember that lymphocytes are of two types again one of the type is known as the t lymphocyte so t lymphocyte jo hoga that is mainly maturing in the thymus gland or t lymphocyte produce karta hai cell mediated immunity but the other type of lymphocyte which is known as the b lymphocyte inka maturation hoga in the bone marrow and these b lymphocytes produces a particular cell known as the plasma cell and the plasma cells are the ones which produce antibodies so major function of the lymphocyte is through the formation of antibodies in one of my segment we'll also discuss about the antibody structure and the type of antibodies but right now moving to the next a granulocyte that is the monocytes now monocytes remember that they are the largest of all the wbcs so in ka dimension is around 15 microns in the nucleus ko observe kare so the nucleus is kidney shaped Apart from this, the kidney shaped nucleus can also be known as a reniform nucleus. These are also A granulocytes and in ka concentration is around 3 to 9 percent. Monocytes ka jo function hai, it is similar to neutrophils. Neutrophils ka function kya pada? It is phagocytic cell. So similarly, E1 monocyte performs phagocytosis. Also, monocytes can come out into the tissue and it enlarges at the site of infection and forms macrophages and it also destroys the microorganisms and even dead cells ka destruction bhi kar sakta hai and hence hum log monocytes ko ek specific terminology dete yaad rakhna they are also known as scavengers avengers nahi scavengers is the term given to the monocytes so this we have discussed in detail about the types of WBCs, the granulocytes and the agranulocytes. Stay tuned for my further videos where in my next segment we'll be discussing about the platelets. That's all from the Painism.